So, hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. And I say we have a good one for today. Now, if you, some, some of you guys might know this already, some of you might not. The fact that you don't know is quite probably concerning right now. Um, this involves the BBC Parmalama. They recently did a program where they interviewed a bunch of uh, NHS doctors and nurses to talk about the NHS and the devastation of the NHS. And to a lot of people, it was true to be shown that the NHS is suffering and it's not going very well. But all the people that they interviewed were Labour activists. That's right. They have been tricked. Some fucking east, I know that. So the BBC Pamalama, oh my fucking god. The, I mean, you. this was actually first realised instantly after Pamalama actually like, released the actual programme by Guido Fox. Thank god to him to actually see, noticing this so we can all talk about it. So basically what happened was they interviewed all these different people, right? They interviewed all these different people and then they all turned out to be actual activists for Labour. And you just can't go over it. It just shows the stupidity of the BBC. And if it was actually done on purpose by the BBC, no, it was done on purpose by the Labour activists to get onto there and criticise the Conservatives for not giving them enough money. Now, if anyone actually knows the NHS, they know it's badly managed. That's probably why we're better than Germany is better than us. But as far as the long thing there, it's badly managed. That's probably why you can give it a lot of money, but it wouldn't work. Because they don't know how to what, spend the money, or they would know how to spend the money on transgender issue hospitals which would force children to become different genders. Look it up, it actually happened. So we're going to talk about these guys. And yeah, I can't believe it myself. I, I really can't believe it. So let's go and take a look at these uh, so-called doctors and nurses. We have Libby Nolan, which is a nurse. Oh, that's great. Oh, no, she's not. Libby, Nurse Libby Nolan is a un, un, union 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 uh, steward, attends Corbin Lally's, Sack Hancock, called for action against the government, so she's a Labour activist. Oh, well, that couldn't be so bad. Oh, like right. Ario Enold, a doctor. Mm, that's pretty interesting. No, that's right. Doctor, member of the docs, not cops. Hmm. And she's also supported the free migrant NHS access. Hmm. Okay. What about anything else? Describe the toys as privatizing, hard mauling, immigrant hating plots. Oh, God. What else? Oh yeah, she's anti-Israel. Well, you just know these Labour guys are really for the fucking money, aren't they? Good on them. I mean, they couldn't be any worse. What about Sonia? I just uh, saw if I'm saying your name wrong, but I'm not really caring. She is a doctor. Oh no, she's fucking not. She is a former Labour candidate. Oh, even served in the Corbyn... Featured in the Corbyn videos. Which can actually be found. Um, shared stage with Jeremy Corbyn. Spokesman at Corbyn Lally. Wikipedia declared to her activism. Wow. You guys are really doing a good fucking job. Anyone else? What about this guy? Oh, this guy. Dr. Asaf Musan. Oh, no. No, he's he's a pro Corbyn, a tax new Tory, lead wall voters, and anti Tory. Okay, and let's try this guy at the end. I'm gonna fuck this guy's name up. Um, Abu Ab Abu Manti Gan I, um, I don't even know. Um, anyway, so he is a force to stand down from the willow. G C C G for fuck's sake. <laughs> uh, supported momentum. Supported 
supportive of Labour, called Minister Popompous fool. Some east. Where the hell does Labour get these fucking people, honestly? And the thing is, it's not its not even as bad as it can get. Because apparently all these guys were actually given to the BBC on purpose to actually completely be biased. And the person you have to thank for is Neil Flanagan. Neil Flanagan, Union... Organizer, communist, L-U-F-C, father of the Yorkshire man with proud source of tendencies, <laughs> for fuck's sake. And what did he say about this when he was asked? He was pretty fucking pleased about the, what he did. I was one of those who spoke to Parliament, and I put them in touch with health workers that told me they would not let them down and would tell the truth. They did, and you should all watch it. Hashtag Palama. Well, at least I know I'm paying my fucking TV license. Yeah. You just don't get it, do you? And that's actually going against the national guidelines because you're not actually allowed to take people in who are actually, you know, for activists on the contributors to the, you know, make it biased. I think I got that right. And this is a bit on the Guido Foxes here. The BBC's own electoral guidelines, which state that contributors' affili <laughs> affiliations that appropriate information about their affiliations funding a particular viewpoint should be made available to an audience when relevant to a context. No, your job as the media is to get the views from both ends of the view, and the viewer will decide themselves. If you knew how to do your fucking jobs, we wouldn't be wanting you to be out of the job, BBC. I've probably got that long somewhere. But, you just you just don't get it these days, do you? This, this... Oh, God. You just, I, you don't get it. I don't even get it sometimes. But... What do you know? It's not like the BBC's going to do anything else stupid this week, is it? It's not like they've been fear-mongering us, you know, against this coronavirus. But, may I guess, we could get better. And we could get worse. Keep going, BBC. We'll see what happens at the end. So guys, thank you very much for watching this video to the very end. That means I'm excellent for this channel. I mean, if you want to support this channel even further, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe this video or the channel in any other sort of way. And if you want to support this channel even further than that, which would be appreciated anyway, please be sure to click any links below for alternative means where we can get more content out to you guys. And remember, hail the Empire!